Welcome back to another weapon video video and today we're going to take a look at the Tenora Prime. So we have the Tenora Prime here and we all should know what the Tenora Prime does. Now I got these best builds for you guys and it's one of my most favorite builds of all time right now for the Tenora Prime. So let's go ahead and take a look at the stats. 30% crit chance which is good, very high. Uh, crit multiplier is 2.2, good. Fire rate 12.67, good. Magazine 200, good. Reload 2.5, good. Status 24%, pretty good. Impact, base damage 8.4, not so bad. As the, the base damage is decent enough, so not so bad. Uh, charge, we have crit chance, and this is the charge, it's the second all fire. So the crit chance is 40%, which is very high, which is good. Charge rate, good. Crit multiplier is 3, very high and good. Fire rate is 2, good. The reload, same. And the status, pretty decent. Base damage, looking very high and looking pretty good. Especially that puncture damage. But I would not be showing the uh, second all fire because it's just... I don't think it's going to do that much damage if we're really talking. But... Obviously, just the normal fire rate, and or just say the normal fire, the rapid fire is going to be better. So, here's my first build. We have the galvanized chamber, the vital sense, the hunter munitions, the speed trigger, which I learned this is a really good mod, and we'll see the damage with that. Infle infected clip in the Kyra rounds, which equals the, um, you already know. Crit delay and the uh, galvanized amplitude. So, we got some crit going on here and yeah primary merciless as our arcane which gives us a lot of a lot of ammo maximum and it gives us reload speed and this thing stacks up to 12 so you're gonna be seeing a lot of great damage now I just found our speed trigger just makes the thing so much better like you can see, I forgot how it goes, or something like that. Uh, but this thing is so good. But you might probably might be thinking, oh, major, that wasn't all that. Like, what are you talking about? That wasn't the best. Well, let's move on to the next build, and then let's see what your reaction is. The second build we have is the galvanized scope everything is the same but we just have galvanized scope and we do have our uh two 90 mods all right no uh no um what's it called 60 60 mods and then we have primary deadhead which is going to make our damage even better because we do have 30 percent uh headshot multiplier and then you get the damage that stacks up to three Now this thing is going to be going, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Especially you're going to be seeing some uh, crit damage going here. Now you're not going to see no red crits because I just found out that, yeah, you're not going to be doing red crits. But you do see some crazy crit, orange crit over here. And look, look, just wipe them, da -da -da -da, just wipe them out, you know? Fast, easy, crazy, crazy damage you had going on here. Now back to the viral. We got some corpus we need to take down as well. So let's go ahead and test out this build and see the damage. And for the all the second all fire, I mean, you really just got to build up that damage if you want to do a lot of good damage. Especially for the second build, not for the, yeah, maybe for the second build, because you do do a lot of headshot multiplier. Pretty good headshot multiplier, plus you're stacking up damage. So, not so bad. It can definitely probably do some damage. But this is corpus, so do keep that in mind. They're too dang easy to take out. Especially if a uh, slash is effective on health. So, too dang easy. If you guys did enjoy these two builds, let me know in the comments below what you think about them. I think the second build you might like most because of the crit and this speed trigger just made it so much better. Primary deadheads in there. So a lot of damage you're going to be doing with that arcane and you got all your galvanized mods. So please let me know in the comments below what do you think about these two builds.
you probably are not expecting this outro, but I want you guys to take this to the steel path and let me know in the comments below, does this weapon work in the steel path with these builds? So that's what I want you guys to do and comment down below if they work. But that's all for this video. If you guys did enjoy it, make sure you leave a like and make sure you subscribe if you're new to the channel. Follow me on all social medias and Twitch. Links in the description. Thank you so much for watching. Love you guys and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.